the fourth day of our novena in honor of St. Joseph, Joseph the humble man. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. O God, come to my assistance. O Lord, make haste to help me. O God, in your divine providence, you were pleased to choose blessed Joseph to be the spouse of the Immaculate Virgin Mary and the guardian of your only begotten Son, made man. In your mercy, you have given us St. Joseph as an example of holiness and a protector during our earthly pilgrimage. By the grace of the Holy Spirit, we pray, open our minds to understand the depth of your love for us. Look kindly on our prayer, and through the powerful intercession of St. Joseph, grant us all the graces we need to follow Jesus as our Lord and Savior, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Today's reading is taken from Pope St. John Paul II. St. Joseph is the model of those humble ones that Christianity raises up to great destinies. He is the proof that in order to be a good and genuine follower of Christ, there is no need to do great things. It is enough to have the common, simple, and human virtues, but they need to be true and authentic. Faithful imitator of Jesus and Mary, humble Joseph, you who were as lowly in your eyes and in the opinion of men as you are great before God, teach me to be like you, lowly and humble of heart. Alas, you know it, my sins, after having made me ungrateful to my God, have filled me again with a foolish pride, which is my soul's greatest wound. O kind saint, my protector, my patron, and my father, on this day I ask you for a virtue which is the foundation of all Christian perfection. Obtain for me humility, the grace to know myself and to despise me. Obtain for me the grace to seek to please God alone in all my actions. May I, like you, love silence and the hidden life. May I, like you, be forgotten and despised by creatures. May the humiliations and the cross of Jesus Christ be my share in this world as they have been yours. O oh, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, I now wish to put all my glory and my delights into humbling myself following your example. Amen. O oh, blessed Saint Joseph, tender-hearted Father, faithful guardian of Jesus, chaste spouse of the Mother of God, I pray and beseech thee to offer to God the Father, his divine Son, bathed in blood on the cross for sinners, and through the holy name of Jesus, obtain for me from the Eternal Father the favor I now implore. Amen. <laughs>